you learn from storytelling. Like if you tell a story and then you're, um, whatever they, whatever the story is told from the elders long time ago are the truth. Because I use that in my class. I use myself as the, you know, whatever they talk about. I was an alcoholic, then I did this, and I didn't like it. And look at how old, 50 some years old, and I got my education. You guys can do it. You know, it's the truth. The storytelling and uh, um, how would it, powwows. I dance at the, I dance at powwows. I'm the, I dance jingle dress in golden age, you know. And my son is a traditional dancer and he has a drum. That drum is very sacred to us though. And the circle of life into that drum way and the things that we learn from our ancestors is the truth. You never learn it from the book. I never learn anything from the book, but I learn, I teach the children from what my grandmother tells me, what my mom told me, what my dad told me, you know, and that's the truth because the books never tell you the truth. It comes from the, your ancestors and your ways of life that they tell you. That's the life that we should be always with us. Sometimes when I go gambling, I feel guilty because, you know, some of that money that you're spending, you could be doing something, maybe buy tobacco, make tobacco ties for the sun dance. I always think about that, you know. And it is right what the ancestors tell us. We should always follow, you know, our, you know, I always tell that to the students. Many years ago, when a man walks, a woman never walks in front of that man. That was so sacredly. If a man walks and him and his wife walk, they'll see he'll walk ahead and his wife will walk ahead. And when you, when, and we broke that so many times, you know, and like now I broke that too. My, when you drive with, on a road, well, we never had, the, uh, when they had wagons, the man would, uh, the, Son will, uh, like, like if you say your oldest son was driving, you drive and you sit in the back. You never sit by your son. And when I think about it, when I travel with my boy, I travel a lot with my boy. He, he drives me all over. I go powwows with him. And I sit in the front seat and I always tell him that, hey, I broke another one on my circle. Oh, that's a long time ago, mommy. I said. But you know, you feel guilty when you see those things. There is a lot of traditional ways that we have to learn that we are already breaking, you know.